Court the Lakes Brock. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I'm pleased to rise today to mark International Volunteer Day. Uh, we all know that volunteers are the heart and soul of Ontario, and we're incredible, incredibly privileged to live in a province where civic pride and volunteerism form the bedrock of our communities, and it, and it does contribute to such a beautiful social fabric and unites us across our vast geography and our, our diverse backgrounds. Uh, I also want to recognize the five, almost five million volunteers in our province who demonstrate exemplary self-sacrifice, putting the needs of others above their own. I don't think I, almost every single event in our communities is supported by volunteers, whether it's the, the parades, the festivals, the hospital auxiliaries, the fundraising foundation, to people coaching our athletes, to our many service clubs. Uh, volunteers are the re part of the reason we have such a vibrant and healthy community, and they speak to a very deep Canadian pride that often goes unnoticed. In um, 2010, more than 13.3 million people volunteered, and Canadians devoted 2.1 billion hours to those activities, which is a report from uh, TD. Uh, bank that I found, and all those hours combined is equal to 1.1 million full-time jobs, uh, or 8 percent of full-time jobs in Canada. I, I just think that's a, such a statistic that we all should be so proud of. I, I also want to say, as critic to, uh, for citizenship and immigration and international trade, that uh, I'm certainly proud of all the communities and the private sponsors for uh, stepping up to the plate and accepting uh, Syrian refugees into their homes to their communities, and uh, I think it shows a great compassion as we as Ontarians and Canadians have. Um, and I've said on many occasions uh, in this legislature and in my community events uh, how, how proud I am to live in a province in a country uh, where there is a, we have a place of opportunity for everyone, and uh, I think that just strengthens our diversity and, uh, and helps us all succeed in this globalized world. Um, a favorite part of my job, of course, is thanking all the volunteers in all of our communities and across the province, and I don't think you can ever thank them enough. And I want to share my time with the member from Halton Hills who wants to say a few words. So thank you to all.